Hey guys, welcome back to some more Hawken. This time we're doing the Rocketeer, which I have on test drive, so I can kind of do anything I want. So the two, uh, he has the Hellfire missiles as a primary, Seeker missile, and also EC, EDC repeater, which I'm going to show you first, actually. Uh, because I would never use it. Uh, and let me show you why. You hold it down, it spams these things, and then uh, they kind of stay there, and then they blow up. So, um, the other, the other option is much better. And anyway, so you have Hellfire missiles, and the entire point is that you, uh, you kind of, uh, just spam away at people. And, and this is actually, uh, what I can best describe as an artillery class. It's actually quite, quite good at that. So you can see, like, people are running away from me, and I'm gonna go run over here. He's really good at this. It's amazing, actually. Like, it's just, um... I was playing it wrong, actually, the first time I, I played through this. And I'll tell you, I'll tell you pretty much what I was doing. I was kind of going up to people and I was trying to kill them, like, up close. And it's just... You're actually not intended to do that at all. Or maybe you can. Like, some people actually call this, like, an overpowered class. Uh, and it... Maybe, who knows? But, um, it's because, like, a lot- all of his abilities, basically, require absolutely no aiming on your part. Uh, it's just- they lock on. See, this missile lo will, will lock on to enemies that are close to your crosshair, which is kind of cool. Um, and so you just press, like, the middle mouse button, and it shows up this little lock-on meter. And what you're really good at doing is you're good at just- just nuking people. And I'm just, I'm just going ahead and killing him. Oh, there we go. Okay, so I got an assist for that one. Um, but basically, this is like one of the first heavy classes I've actually played since, I don't know when. But, um, you're, you're really freaking slow. Uh, you can, it appears as if you can go the same distance as a light class. But, I don't really know. And, you know, honestly, I'd maybe recommend, uh... So I'm overheating. I'd maybe over recommend having that 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 third button uh, be something else because it's kind of a little bit on the ridiculous side. I, I don't have like my fingers in, in the traditional sense. So I'm gonna go. Uh oh, I don't want to engage these guys. Okay, so we're gonna go down here. Oh man, you you are fat and slow as as this mech. I don't care. I'm gonna be over here. Like, you are really, really badly slow, but it's, this is the kind of class where you just want to do damage and, and soften people up and, and do kind of, just long range artillery kind of thing. Oh, unfortunately I did not lock in it. Oh, let's go get this guy. Fuck this guy. There we go. And so you just, that's all you're doing is you're locking onto people and like constantly just tur like harassing them with missiles. And you cause like a like it's it's actually kind of a fun class. It's just uh you gotta you gotta play it in a certain way. It's it's basically if you like to play kind of like a sharpshooter kind of thing with missiles and and be a heavy class. And so I'm going to show you his, his special ability uh, a little later uh, because I'm not in a good position at all right now to do it, use it. And I see, I constantly am seeing people here. Uh, and we got that guy. There you go. See, that's that's kind of what you just have to do is you just uh, lock on your missiles and just take advantage of the fact that they're all going to home in. And it's just very fire and forget kind of a thing. And it's amazing how much how much devastation you can cause. And so, like, now that I've actually played this class, I kind of understand it a little better. Okay, we need to get the hell out of here. Because uh, someone's nuking me. So you just, you just kind of rain hell from above. And you just keep firing missiles and keep utilizing uh, all, all these things to your advantage. Okay. You EMP'd me, then ran away? All right. 
But the, the problem becomes is you, although you are a heavy class, you are not, not capable of taking out like the entire team on your own. Like it's just, you're not a tanky kind of a guy. I'm sure you can expect to kind of be a little bit more tanky, but um, this is this is the reason I kind of, you become like a very opportune target and you're actually very weak uh, when, you do, when you play like that. So you gotta, and you also gotta take into account your splash damage and all that kind of fun stuff. So I'm gonna show you the, uh, this mode, which is basically, he's very heavily defensive. And so I'm just gonna go ahead and uh, cause a bunch of problems with these guys. Now, the disadvantage of this class is uh, you cannot, uh, with this mode basically, you cannot repair. Uh, and you, you are very slow. But, you are, ver you are very uh, needy, so. So, I win, there we go. Unfortunately, I think I'm gonna lose because uh, I have to go back into this mode basically to repair, oh god. Well, that was it for me. And that's the problem. Everything you do is slow. You cannot run away from things and you just, it's, you're, you're the best as like just shelling people as a, as a tillery. And that's what I do. I was actually going to play this in like missile mode or missile command or whatever the hell it's called. I couldn't do it. It just, it's the fact that you have to stand on points and run after people. It just, uh, it, it wasn't working out for me too well. And you know, I, I needed to actually a lot of time to kind of figure out how this class worked because it's, uh, it's not, not really that easy as it, as it looks. Um, it, some people say it's really easy. Maybe, as I said, I'm just doing it wrong. Uh, what the hell? There we go. So let's go walk up this guy. I'm overheating. Oh, some sharpshooter's going after me. Damn it. I, I certainly hope that they don't know I'm here. Because it takes you forever to repair. <laughs> and so, you know, maybe maybe you'll opt not to use that little special mode. I, I had a little bit of fun with it just being on top of, like, a, a large place. Um, all the heavy classes basically have that fortification mode. Um, but this class in particular b gains apparently increased speed. What? Oh, he went downstairs. Um, and I also get like a missile turret unlock for one of my first things, so that's kind of cool. Fortunately, I can't really do much here. All right, let's just place our missile thing over here. And all I hear is just like missile spamming everywhere. Oh, someone got him. That's a shame. So, like, apparently, apparently this can be a really strong class, uh, but I'm just telling you the best way I found to play it and what I found it was good for. So, there's very little uh, hardcore aiming involved. It's it's very much just figuring out where they are, getting that missile lock, and that's it. Ah, uh, missed him. Hey, I got him. See, it goes like behind the corner even. It's it's actually kind of ridiculous. So it's Unfortunately, I think someone, someone sees me. There we go. Luckily, luckily I was getting repaired by that. Oh, uh, what? He just, you see what I mean? Like, the lights love to run after you. It's just, it's kind of just their calling in, in life, apparently. And, uh, I, I think that's why it's just your clumsy class kind of a thing. So you're, you're gonna die a lot. And so, I, I don't know, it's just, but when you catch someone out in the open, it's kind of like this, and you have full health, you win. Oh, get out of here. Unfortunately, it's just like, I can't take two people out at once, and I can try my best to like, get away, but the, the light class is just gonna run. The light classes dominate you. It's it's the weirdest relationship I've seen. Like, the, the light class is doing really well. But if you catch the light classes out in the open, you win. Uh, but if if they're like, uh, being very smart about it, and they're like, like coming coming up to you when you're weak, they're very good at finishing you off. 
and there's no running away. So, like, all things are considered being equal uh, when they when you it's just you versus them. Uh, you have the advantage, but if it's just like you fighting another guy and then the light comes in and all that kind of stuff, like you know, I'm used to being able to run away as a uh, as a light, you know, because I, I was playing light classes a lot. But um, you know, but if I can't if I can't run, I can't repair, and so that means that I can finish one person off with maybe just like a little bit under half my health. But when there's like two people, another guy comes. I can't really do much. It's just nothing I can do, which is kind of I don't know. It's it's as I said it's um it's a class you may you may enjoy if uh, you know you well it, it's one of those things like it's kind of like an either a bombardment class or maybe you don't want to uh, you you have trouble like aiming or something in a game like this because it is kind of uh, it's a little strange and and you'll see it when you get to, into it. So maybe it's maybe it's like a useful class in that that regard. Uh, I, I don't want to call it a, 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 a noob class or an easy class. I just think it's uh, kind of like, I guess, like either like Juggernaut in in, uh, in Tribes, which is definitely easier, but doesn't mean it's less fun or less, uh, less I don't know, less legit than another, another chassis of mech, you know? Because I don't want to start some sort of flame war with someone who really likes this. Because I think it's fine. It's just not something I prefer to play, but I'll, I'll definitely show you a bit more. But yeah, that that I don't even understand the point of that this ECD launcher. It's just you, you it sticks to surfaces, and that's pretty much it. And and b with the fact that your 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 primary or or your whatever your main weapon, uh, the the missile, the Hellfire missile launcher, is a home on a homing in launcher, then yeah, it's like why why would you ever do that? So. Here I can go down here, and I could go into my little boat. And so this is useful for if you're if you're just wanting to, uh, and this is where actually that support item for healing really comes in handy. I don't have it uh, with me, but because I, I really want to show you all the classes, uh, and there's four versus four. But um, it's it, it could be useful. It could be useful in that sense. It's just preventing damage while you're far away. guys try to do it he's not going to succeed because that's what i mean heavies can easily be bombarded it looks like he put on that thing where uh he has the radar jammer so i'm just gonna go repair real quick so i know you were watching me jump around as scout and basically uh it's not quite the same This guy's screwed. There we go. And you have to lock on that missile launcher. It's just it's just not as useful. What? I thought it took you out. Oh no, apparently. Okay, I did take you out. Alright, well let's just repair real quick. Uh oh. So I'm gonna take out this guy because he's the closest threat to me right now. And I'm gonna also put a, a nice little guy down here. A little turret just to give me a little bit of assistance. And me and Mr. Blue Sky are going to just dominate as the the, the, the three rocketeers, or I know there's not a third one. Fuck, why isn't there a third one? Uh, he's, yeah, he's a rocketeer too. Okay, the first person who makes the client three rocketeers wins all the internets. So, it's just, it's just something you... you you sell at is basically this and and it's so easy to get like like get rid of the, the rockets because all you do is you just duck around a corner and then but uh, you know get used to like not finishing people off because uh... oh -ho! and I got him that was that was close, and I, you can you, you'll see you notice how fat and slow I am. It's just really really bad. So you, just, you kind of just get used to people like running after you, finishing you off. But you you have a lot of firepower. Ah, I got him too. <laughs> We're just both shutting down. <laughs> Time to repair. Oh man. Okay, this is not good. Okay, I'm gonna just... 
Defend my teammate. Uh. So you can stay. You can kind of hover for a little while. Okay, I'm gonna get the hell out of here. I'm gonna go down here because I, I need to repair. Oops, or not. I'm just gonna keep falling down. Because unfortunately, they can repair much faster than I can. I I have to. I have to be very cautious about my health, so I'm just gonna let them kind of go fight up there amongst themselves. Alright. And so I can kind of just curve, curve bullets, I guess, around corners. But, you know, you, you are extremely good at just... Uh, I want to kill that guy. Oh god. He's gonna want to finish me off, so let's go down here. Remember, every every uh, kill you don't give them in deathmatch is uh, one kill they don't have. Wow, this is actually like nobody's dying on this team. This is really good. Finally, amazing team, go. So you know, it's 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 a, it's a nice class. I, I kind of I, I kind of have grown an appreciation for it. So that's the thing, he's gonna just hug the corner kind of a thing and try and get me from over there, but I'm not gonna fight him on his terms. I mean, you're gonna have to come to me if you want that kill, man. <laughs> See what I mean? There we go, we win. Don't ever fight someone on their terms. Fight where, where you have the advantage or just back off. And then, uh, since he wasn't corner humping there, uh, he, was, he was screwed. Which is the exact strategy I would be using, to be honest. So, you know, I can't fault him for that, but, you know, all is fair in Hawken and War, or whatever. Anyways, um, this, I can, I can definitely see, like, a, a high damage output kind of, uh, class going, go, class let out kind of, kind of going on. I don't exactly understand all the intricacies about this class, like, I don't know if you have to lock on every single time. To attack someone, and I am stuck on something. But you are extremely slow, so speed is not your thing. If you do not feel the need for speed, uh, you may find it in your something you enjoy. But you can see, I just, I just destroyed that kid. And this guy, you see what I mean? Every time they fight you out in the open, it's they're gone. <laughs> it's good game for them. All right, they're repairing the corner here. They can only come from like two directions, so it works in my favor. But yeah, everything takes really long. So, and this is like the, this is the C kind of class mech. They call it the C class, which is like the heaviest kind. The B is sharpshooter and assault, and A is the ones I've already done videos on. Okay. I like how he tried to come in at that moment. He's like, oh wait, I EMP'd him. Oh, you committed suicide. Oh, that's sad. Makes me very sad. Still have not died. Uh, I don't know how I'm, I'm winning right now, but don't take that as uh, necessarily that this is just such an amazing class that you'll never die. Um, but you have to be playing, like, to, as, a, as an effective Rocketeer, I, I, in my opinion, you have to be playing artillery. That's the best solution. You don't run up to people. Uh, you let them let them go if if uh, if they choose not to fight you. It's not your it's not necessarily your job to to run after them because that's that's what your lights are for. The lights will do that. Oh. I'm just gonna touch up because every little bit of health counts. Uh, they're also over there. So, close range is not really your ally. Do 
you don't have to necessarily lock on. It's it's in your best interest to, but you don't have to. Um, so if, if if you feel that they're not they're not going to move from that position, then don't bother. Is someone shooting me from anywhere? I think he just misses grenade on someone else. And that would be a poor scout mech. That poor scout mech. And we get the heavy. And that one's ours too. So much damage. No, not my first death. Oh yes. Oh god, no, no. Save me. Save me, other mechs. Don't block my way. 